Welcome everybody to Flatlands Podcast. It's been a while since I've done an intro. And you got it right. He got it right, but he always forgets to say the T at the end of podcast. I always go podcast. It's true. There you go. He he takes the T and mm-hmm. adds it into the. He makes podcast and the one word. Because he doesn't say the T in the cast. I know. More efficient. I guess. Not proper spelling, but yeah. He, he's doing what we did when we separated it from England all those years ago. <laughs> now he's changing. <laughs> we're changing. Where we change how we spell shit. Mm-hmm. We took the U out of a lot of words. <laughs> Say, because we got the coronavirus coming around, drive out to the deserted island. What are five things you'd take with you? You only take five. Well, one, I'm taking, obviously, I'm taking one of my bang bang sticks. That's for sure. Probably taking two. So that's now two. You only have three things you can take left now. Yep. True, but I but if I have my rifle and my pistol, I can defend myself with the pistol. I can hunt with the rifle. This is true, or you could do both with one. Yeah, but sometimes you need to get a little bit more range. Yeah, but you still could do both with one. True. Because I just said one of my bang bang sticks mm. with all the ammo, of course. Well, yeah, that, that's all. I now, would that count? It would that count as still as one thing bringing the ammo, or that only count? That would that count as two then bringing all the ammo with Counts the bang bang? Two. Uh, so, well, then that right, then I would only bring the rifle. Yeah, and so, then all the ammo. So one of my bang bang sticks with all my ammo. Yeah. Okay. And then hmm. bring enough toilet paper. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> toilet, paper. <laughs> toilet, paper yeah. toilet paper. Oh wait, you can't get any more. Oh, fuck. Yeah, oh, damn. damn it's all, yep. Well, all, at least all toilet paper. Luckily, I'm out. not planning on being on a deserted island. You, uh, you need banana leaves <laughs> next. This time hope, hope, hope that you have banana leaves on your deserted island. Yeah. I'd probably take my one man tent, so I have a little bit of a shelter. Or what you could do is just go out in the ocean and take a shit in the ocean. Yeah, yeah, this is true. Yeah, because the amount of shit you'd be shitting wouldn't be, but see, would contaminate it because of nope. all the fish shit that's already in it. Yeah, all right. But see, also if you're going to a desert desert island, if you took MRE, you won't have to worry about shitting anyways. This is true. Mm-hmm. Like so you that have one, a food that source. one meme I sent you. Yeah, can't worry. You don't have to worry about toilet paper if you can't shit, and it's a picture of an MRE. Yep. But yeah, like if you brought an MREs, you'd have food. We'll have food, and you wouldn't have to worry about going to the. You'd also have so you a heat. You'd have a heat source too. You would. Yeah, especially. You'd if it's also hard have to... matches to start fire. Yeah. So I would take a case of emery's. Yeah. It's Twelve mils. Yeah. You can stretch those out. You could stretch them out. Also, too, you could hunt in the meantime yeah, too. You and could yeah. find food and cook that. So, all right. So. so we got ammo. We got a bang bang ammo. stick, and we got food now. Yeah. So that's three things. So that's three. And also, oh. in the emery, it comes with toilet paper. So true, it does. And I said a one man shelter. I got my one man tent shelter, so I would okay, take so that. So you got four. So I got. Four. I have three. Yeah. Give three. Yeah. So I have a case of emery, bang bang stick, and ammo. Because at least with my one man tent, I can casually build a shelter instead of having to rush one. Well, no, 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 now. So with me, I'm I'm looking at my second thing to bring my ammo would be my ammo crate. But inside of that, I could fit a knife. So technically, I can get away with having an extra thing. Oh, you're right. We, or if you attach a bayonet to your bang bang stick, yeah. that's a knife that, that you could take off. Uh-huh. Loophole. Yeah. You did find a loophole. Yeah. There we go. You're right. So do that. And I could have I could have a knife with me. So that way I can then be able to skin animals mm-hmm. and yeah. since i'm going to be on the, on there who was saying that i couldn't find a rock that i could sharpen my knife on then it's true but if you can pack your knife in with your ammo you might be able to put a whetstone in with it this is true because I, I if i'm bringing my ammo can and i can the one that can hold my magazines mm-hmm. you can fit a lot of knives and, and even more extra ammo in there in between the mm-hmm. the spaces yep. of Ah. Along with the case that my my bang bang stick's gonna be in, yeah, more ammo in there. Holy shit, I'm I'm set now. <laughs> <laughs> and you can take more bang bang sticks. There we go. Yes, yeah, so I can still have my pistol. Uh-huh. You with, still carry your mm-hmm. your baby there. Yes, yeah, so I I literally have found a loophole for my bang bang stuff. You, you did. I I would put my rifle and shotgun in the same case, and I can hunt bird really well. Let's see, there you go. This is not where I thought on this to go <laughs> at all. <laughs> Josh was like, you only could take five things. And we're over here going, and we could stuff this and this. And we could put that here, which means hey, hey. we could take 10. You know what you forgot? What? We're veterans. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. We, we know how to pack shit. We know shit. how to pack shit. Drill it tight. <laughs> yeah. Hell, if you ask us, we can make it float too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, I mean, it could be 75 pounds, but it will still motherfucking float. I'll definitely make sure I have jeans so that way I can. Take them off when I do carry go to, a backpack full of clothes. That could be your fourth item. Yeah, but see, like, we could also have a pair of jeans, tie them together, fill them up with air. They could be a flotation device while we fish. Yeah, and see, honestly, if I took a backpack, my one man 
camping system would actually be part of the backpack then because mm. i could strap it onto well, it well also too what, what's saying that we couldn't take a ruck you can make a ruck float and i do still have my ruck mm-hmm. i don't like the fact that it's army digital gray and that's it, that's one extra item right there which then if you pack enough shit in that can, and you could take the frame off of a ruck and use it as a shelter covering if necessary yeah depending on the ruck that you have mm-hmm. yeah so you get that you could you could pack all that shit and extra ammo and extra food mm-hmm. and extra clothing and, and extra, extra fire gear and extra water all within that shit and we that still counts as only your fourth item right there. It's one because item. Josh never so specified that they're so going to search through our shit first and be like, oh, only oh, this much. Because I basically took my four items and turned it into two. Yeah, so like literally, because so food, my food and camping is all in that bag now. In that bag right there, yeah. yeah. So we just got bang bang, bang sticks bang stick and ruck. and and ammo. Ruck. So I'm at three. Three, yeah, yeah, three and the ruck. Yeah, so, we're so now we 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 have two more. Oh, we can. <laughs> <laughs> Never bring, ask a veteran how to take bring five, a, six bring a case of <laughs> fucking you know either beer or in my case Mountain Dew. There's <laughs> we can get one of those two man inflatable boats too, stuff it in the ruck, so we don't even have to worry about flotation. Yeah. Or even if it's not, we can t- attach it to the back of the ruck at least. Yeah. You know, in its own little bag. Mm-hmm. And then, yeah, to make room in there. So there's four right there. So now we have a raft that we can fish with. And also, too, I mean, they do the make ruck, collapsible fishing poles, too. We they do. Stuff in there. We can stuff it in there. Or if we're not able to, we get so enough I, string. I, th- I think that we, we can get away with just three items now. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> I don't think we need the other two. And Steven, you could take ha- a half a one man tent. I could take a one man tent. And if we're both in the same desert island, we could make a full ass tent. And I also do have a poncho and I have a whoopee. Mm-hmm. I can all go in there so we can stay dry and warm. I, I have I have water, uh, like two waterproof bags. Actually, I have all my military gear. Most of that will fit in a fucking ruck. Yeah, like I have I have two two waterproof bags that we could use as well. Exactly. Yeah. So I mean, I, I think we still got two more I things also, to go. I also have had wilderness survival training, so I think I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> and just so, in case, I have some survival books. Mm-hmm. We can take those just in case. Yeah. You know? there, in fact, there's one sitting right over there. You know, if we know we're going to go to there, yeah. tonight, you know, just, yeah. I mean, Josh didn't think this scenario through. I did not. <laughs> I'm total left field right now. I don't even know how to continue this topic. <laughs> <laughs> he was, he was expecting the civilian version. I think I'd take a food, water, <laughs> Yeah, I mean, my deal was going to be I'm just going to take enough fuel for the boat so I can get off the island whenever I wanted. But you didn't specify where that island is, though. Yeah, I just said a deserted are we island. In a, yeah, but are we in a, like the deserted island in New York City, which mm-hmm. literally all you have to do is swim across the fucking Hudson and get back into populism? Popul- deserted island would be more or less defined as far away from civilization that you can get to where you're out on the island and you're not going to see a ship or a plane fly over you. Like you're deserted. Well, then if you have gas for that, you're going to run out of gas and be stranded in the middle of the fucking ocean, sir. Yep. No, I'm just saying. And, you know, I would. Yeah. So basically, you, just, five you, you fucked yourself. The gas. You fucked yourself. Five items that. is gas. Five, uh, five items. Of, five. So basically five gallons of gas for an engine that's going to take all five of those gallons to even get anywhere. And mm-hmm. you're going to run out of it. No, 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 no. And, and I'm taking enough stranded. gas to go there and back. It's more than five. five. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Not if Unless each you're... five container is like... <laughs> and that, yeah, so are you going to be able to lift all those fucking drums the of boat gas? The boat wouldn't even float. Yeah, the boat probably wouldn't even float. What if float I'm taking a that? fucking yacht? <laughs> there well, was technically, no in that yacht, in that yacht, <laughs> there's more than five items, technically. But I'm not taking them, them onto the island with me. So what five items would you take on the island? Well, I already... So we already stick, stick, my rock. Stick. Exactly. Rock. And then, see, I thought of another, a fourth item. Hmm. We can take a bag full of tools with a solar charger so we can keep them charged and we can build shelter that way. Yeah. Or we can just do hand tools and do it that way too. Yeah. We could do that. Let's take a tool bag. So there's four now. Mm-hmm. Next topic. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't even get off through all our five. <laughs> yeah, we're stuck at four. And we're, <laughs> we're going to be comfortable. Okay, bring over your high desk. Downs. This deserted <laughs> island was bring, over high. Just, just bring your laptop and a <laughs> Wi-Fi thing. The Wi-Fi th- range, like <laughs> satellite, you know, just. Yeah. Put it on top of the tallest tree and uh, got signal. Okay, cool. We can watch. We can fucking watch sports, you know. Yeah. <laughs> well, we can't because they're canceled. Yeah, yeah, so, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Can't watch. We can watch Netflix, Netflix though. You can watch prior good. years. You watch last year's sports. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. So oh, I remember that game. Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, they're gonna lose. How much money you want to bet they lose? They lost. Well, <laughs> they lost. <laughs> well, money wasn't one of our four things out of the five we were allowed to take. Yeah. Well, well, we're gonna be living really high, the need highlight. Currency. On a deserted island. How do you know those fucking monkeys wouldn't? One of they got to be monkeys. We could be on a jungle island. We could be. So how do you know the the monkeys that live on that jungle island aren't 
don't have their own civilization that are going to charge us to get a fucking roll of toilet paper. Question is, why would they uh, t- need your kind of currency? You're going to have to take your currency. How do you know they don't have a, chain, uh, a conversion rate? How do you know they're smart enough? Uh, why, are you, why are you assuming that they're not? I'm not assuming. Because they you can are be set in their ways. You're assuming that th- those are dumb monkeys. No, they could be. They could be smart monkeys. How do you know it's not like Planet of the Apes are just stuck on an island? And then you bring your goddamn yacht, they're going to fucking steal your yacht and take over the world. And you're the, you're the sole cause of Planet of the Goddamn Apes. Fuck you, sir. All right, this is week two in a row now. We have a reason to kill Josh. <laughs> <laughs> it's causing well. the end of the world. Yeah. Twice. Oh, well. Speaking of which, since you brought in Planet of the Apes, uh-huh. what would you do in a scenario where, let's say you're on a boat. Okay. You know, say we're all on a, a fishing boat. All right. And do some like deep, Deep sea fishing. Okay. For some reason, we all decide we want to go where the Bermuda Triangle is. We okay. end up getting caught in it. Shit. <laughs> Dude, we're mm-hmm. fucked. Mm-hmm. Boat goes down. Life was good. Yeah, yeah, life was good. Boat goes down. You know, by the time we come up out of the water, it's like we're in another, just like Planet Apes. You're in another era of the world, except run by apes. What would you be doing? I'd probably be shitting myself and then be <laughs> probably running for our lives after that. Well, I'd be shitting myself right. and being pissed off at all those fucking people that panic bought all the toilet paper because I could have had some. You could have yeah. used it at that yeah. moment. You could have. That's some valuable. Mm-hmm. Even those apes didn't know what toilet paper is. How do you know they didn't? Because they, they just never, never saw they, it in just the because, show. Just yeah, because they never, our just because world, they, they flung shit at you at a and, zoo and doesn't just mean because, they didn't earn. And just because in the movie the, they never dived into the whole normal non warring side of the apes. Mm-hmm. How do you know they didn't use toilet paper? How do you know they didn't create it? Because basically they're How do you know they just... didn't create something that's better than toilet paper? How do you know that they did? They don't have a better, more productive society just because they only show the warring side of the planet of the apes? How do you know that they... They could just have didn't... a bunch of bidets and not have to worry about toilet paper. Yeah. How do you know that they didn't, you know, freak out over viruses like we do? How do you know they didn't have to worry about it because they're still animals and their immune system is more developed for that shit than ours? Too yeah, because sure. because we don't, you know, they don't get afraid of germs like we do nowadays. No, mm-hmm. no, no. Josh's topics are just dying right now. <laughs> <'Cause> <laughs> dying. He's, he's <laughs> like, this is this topic. Oh, it's so good. I'm going to stump these guys. And then we're like, yeah, but then we could do this. And like, oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> I didn't think that through. <laughs> <laughs> that civilian mindset, I think. Mm-hmm. You're thinking too. You're you're thinking too inside the box, sir. Too inside the Gotta box. Got to be outside mm-hmm. the box. Outside the box. Yeah, out of the box. Out of the box. Out of the box. <laughs> All right. Well, you want to be out outside the box, put limitations. You're on a cruise ship. Cruise ship goes down. Okay. Okay. You're nice swimming. Ship. Yep. You're swimming towards a deserted island. Okay. What are the five things you would have on your person with you as you make it to the island? Well, my phone's fucked. That's for damn sure. <laughs> yeah. My wallet's soggy. But at least I got my LTC on me, so I will be able to take my gun. Yep. So at least I got that. <laughs> the pins... To a certain extent, your LTC would not cover you in international waters. Mm. But we're technically in international water, though. So we're not under any jurisdiction. True. Depends on who comes by, I guess. Would yeah. be, depend. Well, but also, too, that's why, why do you think the Somali pirates, they attack in international water? True. Mm-hmm. But then again, you also got to think, why do you think the Navy used snipers to shoot? But tar- at that time, they were on technically on U.S. soil because they were on a U.S. vessel. This is true. But we shot Somali pirates off their vessel. No, they were in the they were in those little escape things. They were in the lifeboat. Yeah, oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah, that was from the from the U.S. vessel, therefore yeah. still making it U.S. soil. Mm-hmm. True, because it was being True. towed by the True. battleship. Yeah. Or, yeah. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. so it's all the only thing that was international was the traveling of the rooms. Mm-hmm. So yeah, okay. But what the battleship could have done since they were towing it, they could have towed it into United States waters. But where they were, but where they were really yeah, they were on US regardless. Yeah, that, that would have been a long ass. Yeah, that would have been. But drive if they really want drive. to drive. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, as long as the car right. like, drive into international waters, I'm like oh shit, we can pick up pirates. We gotta go back to the US <laughs> now. <laughs> turn around. <laughs> if you if you pirates don't stop, we're gonna turn this 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 fucking we're gonna car turn around. this carrier around, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> Goodbye. Mm-hmm. Of course, then again, if we're on a carrier, why don't we just put them in a black hawk and just fly their asses back? It'd be faster. <laughs> Fucking even a jet. Mm-hmm. I mean, who's saying we couldn't strap them where the fucking torpedoes would go? They actually do make those naval vessels that shoot out of torpedo tubes. We can drop one in there, drop them in there, but disconnect the motor and everything, drill a couple holes in it so when it launches, it just sinks. 
Could just done that. That's considered a war crime, sir. <laughs> That's considered a war crime. <laughs> in the bottom, if you drop him in the right spot in the oak, the oak spot. What the fuck? <laughs> like right? <laughs> like, how did that happen? <laughs> like I don't know. <laughs> Like it scared me. Like, like I don't, I don't understand how in the world that fucking happened. The look at his face was perfect. Like, and then like it, it only happened on my well. on my track, but then on your track it just went in the right right spot of the right spot of the ocean. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Pro Tools, what are you doing? <laughs> No, no. <laughs> and you delicately <laughs> lay your hand on the computer. <laughs> like, stop. Good job. No, don't do that. <laughs> You're treating it like it's one of your little kitty cats. Like, why? <laughs> We're being nice. <laughs> We're not being mean to you. Oh, shit. Watch me find out it's just your beard rubbing up against it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> So you can't even think like where that, which Mike did that. Mine did, did that it. thing, but his did this weird glitchy thing and yours just my, cut out audio. So you, Yours just went silent. Mine said, my, fuck my vocals. Yeah, and, and yours repeated just said, yours twice and mine just, just went, fuck, you know, like, <laughs> just, like what the fuck? Hold up. Because of Satan, I have to take this from you now. Bitch, that's mine. But you have Satan on your side. Yeah, but he's not going to take my, my gut from me. Well, now if someone breaks in, we're fucked. No, there's one behind you. In the closet. <laughs> I have to get into the closet, though, which means I'm going to have to get up, move my chair, sure. open the door, <laughs> then get the shotgun. Devil is on your side. We'll wait till he's gone. Then you can have your toy back. <laughs> this is all because Josh, dude. It's, I swear it's, it's Josh's fault. 100% Josh's fault. Yeah, because you know where all that starts? Him doing this. Yeah, but also how how I know it's Josh's fault too is literally because of the fact that one he's just making as much noise as fucking possible right now, and then two is because he well, he got pissed off that you know we called him out on his his topics, so he sabotaged the fucking podcast. <sighs> Please double agent for the Illuminati, my ass. Mm-hmm. Double agent, I'm playing both sides of the field. Got to play for the winning team. Whichever team I think's winning, that's the team I'm playing for. End of story. Goodbye. Give me well, my shotgun. Get the fuck <laughs> out. There's the goddamn door. Go to your fucking you car. You get fired for like the fifth time. <laughs> yeah. Going for you, record. You, 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 we keep firing you and you keep, for some reason, showing up. <laughs> You're right. For some reason, he's also still in the group chat. Like, I don't know what the fuck's going on. I don't know. I don't know. But we keep firing you and you keep coming back for no reason. No reason. Yeah. And Perks. I, I, don't, I don't appreciate it. I mean, it. he even showed up for our first attempt to film the podcast. Mm-hmm. Perks. That obviously didn't get posted, you know? Yeah. Perks. Test. I wouldn't say it's perks, sir. No, I would perks. not say it's perks. You don't You don't have that right. Perks. Not even Percocet. Not even Molly. Not even Percocet. It's not even that song. So, oh. so you're fired again. Okay. You fucking Satan summoning bitch. I'll be back next week. If that M- me and John will have to have a founder CEO meeting first. Mm-hmm. Yeah. My, we might have Chris replace you full time now. I mean, he is the only one who's consistently gone international. <laughs> Just by <laughs> luck. But I mean, by luck, you enjoy went international. Yeah, he did. He goes to Germany, I think. Mm-hmm. And you're over here, domestic. Just, you're even, Just keep it real. Probably because of those wet floor signs. Yeah, wet floor. <laughs> <laughs> wet floor. Do y'all do y'all want to know the deal behind the wet floor? Okay, tell me. And domestic violence. All right, sure, I'm ready. You know, you're not ready. I am. No. My butthole's puckered. Go ahead and tell me. Puckered with anticipation. You're gonna have to edit this out. Then why did you mention it? <laughs> <laughs> Joshua Stories. <laughs> This episode was brought to you by Joshua Stories, one that you cannot hear. He asked us to edit this out, and we did. So enjoy the elevator music. So do y'all want to know the deal behind wet floor signs and Go ahead. abuse? All right. This is Officer John. Please send backup. A woman has shot her husband for stepping on the floor she had just mopped. Mm. Well, have you arrested the woman? 
Mm-mm. No, sir. The floor's still wet. Mm-hmm. I've actually seen that one. That looks pretty good. So basically, wet floor signs don't actually stop domestic violence. Or can they? Because you wouldn't step on that wet you floor. You wouldn't step on the wet floor, but gotcha. it's in this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. that, that too. I got the 22 in, out. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, and the civilization. And that one just fucked itself. I didn't even fucking cock right. <laughs> but hey, it. I did the proper thing. I tapped the back. Yeah. It went forward. Didn't do like what happened with me. Right, right, right. What What did you do? It wasn't me that did it. Oh. Yeah, it was this other person that did it. That had an ND. Oh, the hollow points too, apparently. Oh. Did not know I had a hollow point in it. Mm. Mm-hmm. Now you do. Not that you need a hollow point for a fucking 22 long rifle. But, but now you do, though. Yeah. You have that just in case you needed to hollow point that fucking squirrel. <laughs> exactly. Damn squirrels. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, had an ND that happened and shit. And it was... That's all it would have solved it. Yeah, it would have solved that. Also, too, they wouldn't have just pulled the fucking. Anyway, weapon safety rules. Yeah. Fucking follow them. If you're going to fucking use a weapon, follow your fucking weapon safety rules. Mm hmm. Treat every weapon as if it were loaded. Never point your weapon at anything you do not intend to shoot. Keep your weapon on safe until you intend to fire. Keep your finger on off the trigger until you plan to fire. Know your target and what lies beyond it. Mm hmm. Common sense. Yep. Safety's on. God damn, Steven. <laughs> at least at least it's still not like what happened that one time. You remember that, Steven? The Which one, time? one time. There's been a mini a one time. Yeah, but the most recent one time. Here at the same complex. One building, actually two buildings over. Two buildings over. Mm-hmm. On but the this- second floor, New Year's Eve. Or New Year's Day, actually, technically. Oh, yeah, that one, yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's three buildings over. You got one, two, three. Well, yeah. But no, it's technically it's two. A th- it's the third one over. Yeah, but technically it's two. I'm in you, five, you he's skip in two. two. And then you get to that one. But I'm in five, he's yeah, in two. Yeah, but I mean, like, if you skip that yeah, and then, you know, you go to the building. Yeah. 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 You're talking about straight across. Yeah. It's that, one, yeah. that one's all tucked off that yeah. way, off to the yeah. side. Yeah. I, I get yeah. it. Yeah. 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 But yeah, that shit happened. That was interesting. Although, we'll tell you something else interesting, speaking of something along those lines. Okay. I have one of those really big, nice, tall umbrellas, you know, that's really big when you open it up. Mm-hmm. I found it sitting in the living room floor behind some boxes. So I'm still unpacking a little bit. Yeah. Picked it up, and a 5.56 five, round fell out of the umbrella. I didn't know I had a spy umbrella. Hmm. Now you do. Yeah. Mr. FBI agent who's listening, please ignore that. Very interesting. I don't know where else we can go from here, honestly, guys. <laughs> It just went. Yeah, we're all like, dying from the coronavirus, apparently. We're all, well, actually, we're probably all dying from starvation. Satan possessed yeah. the fucking podcast. Yeah. And just like threw everything off fucking course. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why Satan had to get involved. I don't know either. I think it was just Josh because we fucking shot down all his ideas. <laughs> Maybe it's not Satan. Maybe it's the Illuminati because he works for him. That would explain why he's making fucking noises and shit. And think about it. What letters to the main company that owns where he works start with? A. Yeah. But see, How does the, that work with the Illuminati? But see, well, that's getting, with an I. I know <laughs> what it starts with, but because of the similar shape, maybe they diluted as an, a shape, uh, making that a new emblem for them. Because it's not a traditional. The all seeing eye? Yeah, they're changing it up so it's not obvious. Albertsons is the all seeing eye? <laughs> <laughs> he worked for them. I mean, the stretch. Hey. I mean, I, 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 I get where you're going, but I mean, that's. Hey, but a, that's but a, anything involving the Illuminati. A stretch, anyways. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I love you, Steven, and I've, I've been behind you most, <laughs> most everything. But there yeah, are times, you know, when you go, when you go a little crazy, uh, and it's a stretch for him. You know, I, I blame, you know, who I have to live with. I mean, look how crazy he is. It, it, it wears off from time to time. I guess, but I think he rubs on you too much. <laughs> 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 All right. All righty then. Well, I know what's I going mean, through his head right now. He's yes. imagining some shit going on <laughs> right, right now. I, mean, I don't know what the... I mean, a lot of things are coming out right now. No. You know, a lot of developments and stuff. And it's crazy. <laughs> yeah. We'll just shove all that back in the closet. So, but we're just... Uh, <laughs> Probably the best place to put that, actually. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. So, Stephen, go back in. And we're just going... I don't think Josh is the one that needs it now. <laughs> He's right. the one imagining two guys rubbing up on each other now. No. Mm. No. No. No homo. Well, I mean, you're not wearing boot bands, so I mean, no homo or a safety belt. No homo. Anyway, I think we can wrap this episode. It's kind of short, but I think we can wrap this episode here because I don't know what the butt fuckery is happening right now. 
Uh, I'm completely at a loss. I'm honestly, quite frankly, I'm scared now <laughs> because I don't. I think my computer just got the coronavirus. I think just because of what happened. Well, let me go Pretty get the, God, the last episode didn't, didn't fuck up. I know the last episode. I mean, it did kind of fuck up a little bit, but it didn't really go psychotic and shit. So, but I mean, worst case scenario, we can just delete this one too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Move forward, and you know we have enough to cover us for a little bit. Yeah, I guess. Unless we all die from Corona, since your computer apparently got it. I guess so. We're fucked. Yep. Let's sadly. All, let's all just clap them cheeks. <laughs> Maybe the last entry for Flatlands, the podcast. If we all die. Do we need to do a last will and testimony now? All right. If we don't post next week, you know, Satan killed us. <laughs> Satan killed us. Or, or Josh or the Corona. Huh. Or Josh. Yeah. Yeah. But Josh the world we never know. Um... I guess we can give our uh, our mics away to whoever finds them first. Yeah. Uh, except you for know, yours, I mean, they don't want your possessed little snowball over there. I mean, yeah. a, a way that you could you could help us not you know succumb to this and, and keep going, uh, you can follow us on our social medias. You know, our Instagram, Flatlands the podcast. You can follow us on Twitter at Flatland Podcast. You could even you know follow us on our and subscribe to us on our YouTube channel. You know, which is also the same name, Flatlands Podcast. If you wanted to, you could email us, you know, well wishes. Very at, true. Uh, at least give us some comforting information yeah. before we pass. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And, and, and encourage us to keep up the fight, you know. And the email address is flatlandthepodcast at gmail.com. No S on that. Flatland the podcast at gmail.com. If you want to and you want us to keep going, you could even you can even you know, support us support by paying us. for our medical bills for our crowdfund. Yeah, crowdfund on podbean.com, flatlands.podbean. Dot com and you can become a patron there. And I mean, hopefully and, we'll 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 be mm-hmm. back. We don't know. Yeah, it, yeah. Yep. It's gonna take some time. I mean, yeah, it's gonna take some healing. You know. If you really want to think of us, you could always send us toilet paper. Yeah, you could do that too. I mean Yeah, I mean I don't know the address we would have it sent to, but you can always just, just send just, it. Just send it. Yeah. Or or send us, you know, if you want to support us on Patreon. Yeah, on, yeah on, instead of sending us toilet paper, you can fund us by the giving us the amount to get us the toilet oh, paper. Yes, 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 yeah. yes. That way we can go get ourselves. We don't have an address to send it to. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm not giving out my personal address. I mean, we may not live next week, so I mean, that's not really a reason for me to hold back. But right, I'm not but going I mean, to. I'd like to die so that our fans don't come and swarm the place when my parents try to collect my shit. Yeah, right, with right. memorials and shit. Like they did that cockroach at A&M a couple of years back. Yeah. yeah. But, all right, well. All right, Pete. Thank you for listening to Flatlands, the podcast. Does that mean I'm going to have to deal with your mother now? Probably. We're all going to die, but then because I didn't return you home the way I found you, she's going to bring me back from the dead to kill me? Possibly. Probably. Son of a bitch. I know. But anyway, well, thank you everyone for listening to Flatlands, the podcast. I'm Jonathan. And I am Steven. I'm Jeff. Signing off. Bye-bye. Don't cry, Flatlands. The podcast will be back next week. I promise. Yes, it will be. It will. Fucking Josh Rudes, everything. (laughs) I know. I don't know anymore. (laughs) I don't know. This is a really weird outro. (laughs) (laughs) This is really weird.